Hi, this is Dave Mass for HomesCountyTicket.com. Welcome to another episode of Ticket TV. We're here tonight, joined by the West Holmes Lady Knights head basketball coach, Lisa Patterson. Lisa, welcome to the show. Thanks, Dave. Appreciate you having me. No problem. Our pleasure. Well, over the years uh, that you've been head coach, you have kind of developed a program that has been uh, very well recognized throughout the state, and, and that continues to grow and grow. And uh, that really kind of starts with these kids at a young age. You've developed a feeder program where these kids are kind of getting themselves into the, the mode that you want them to get in. Talk about the importance of that aspect of your team. Um, you know, and you say I developed it, but um, it, this uh, program was in place well before I ever came here. Um, I, I went through the system as well, and there has always been a program in place. We try to tweak things and make it, you know, our own, our own take on it. But um, we have a couple things that we t that we do with our with our youth. We try to get them started um, as soon as they're out of second grade, going into third grade that summer. Um, we do the park district actually does ball handling before that, but. Um, ourselves, we, we get into it when they're going into third grade. That summer before, we have our summer camp, usually in the summer, and we try to identify kids that, you know, look like athletes, mm -hmm. more or less, that, that want to get involved. Um, then we, um, we do um, four different travel teams. We do a third grade, fourth grade, fifth grade, and sixth grade travel team. And um, when they're younger, traveling doesn't consist of any more than going to Worcester and yeah. play in the Worcester right. League. Um, as most teams do. As they get a little older, fourth, fifth, and sixth, then we, there's all kinds of youth tournaments that we take the kids to. Um, we have different people in charge of different levels. Um, sometimes kids will stay with the same coach all the way through, sometimes not. Um, we kind of set up their gym time and practice time, and I, I try to be there. A lot of it's on Sundays. Uh, at the high school and I try to make my face known and seen and, and just make sure things are going well but part of our success is the people that we have involved yeah uh, absolutely mm -hmm. you know when they when they invest so much time into it so that's one thing that we do the other thing that we do is um, what we call little lady nights and that is um, in November and part of December on Monday nights we take a chunk of our practice time um, on Mondays and bring in th those kids plus any other kid that has an interest in basketball and we work with them a couple nights um, and then we have our own little league there and those are the kids you see playing at halftime of our games. Okay. But they work with our high school kids. I feel it's so important for them to work with those kids and then they come and watch them play. It just kind of makes a right. connection. Yeah, and those and those players today are kind of their heroes they look up to Absolutely. and kind of strive to become. Uh, in today's competitive high school game, is there any way that you could possibly survive without doing that kind of groundwork? Not, not really. It's so very important to get kids interested at a young age, and then you know you don't want to you don't want to burn them out. You you got to kind of watch how much they're involved. But you know some some people go crazy over it, and there's a fine line. But you know it's very very important if you want to have a, a program that's successful. Absolutely. All right. So there you have it. From the ground up, the West Holmes Lady Knights continue to be just a dominant program in the state of Ohio, and uh, just a, it's been a tremendous program for years and years. And Lisa continues that fine tradition. Thanks for joining us tonight at HomesCountyTicket.com. I'm Dave Mast, and for all of us here, thanks for joining us.